Hey everybody, Nikki Brown here. So apparently there is a lawsuit against Navient and um, they may potentially be forgiving some student loans. And if you went to one of these for-profit schools, you may actually be eligible. Um, You can go to NavientAGSettlement.com to find out more information. These schools are listed under number six. Um, there are some other um, eligibility requirements depending on whether or not you had a private loan or a federal student loan um, just make sure you go to studentaid.gov and update your address if you think that you are eligible um, it is based on your current address so people who live in these states are eligible but I think like North and South Dakota Wyoming um, a few states were not eligible so depending on what state you live in um, but it's it does include at least 38 of the states um, let's see you don't have to do anything uh, other than to make sure that your your address is is updated um, and if you are eligible they will automatically qualify you and forgive your loans accordingly um, Navient apparently will no longer be servicing federal loans I think they're only going to do private loans um, going forward But this is good news for people who maybe have been turned down for a home, a loan, a personal loan, a business loan, um, or whatever other situation, or just struggling to keep up and pay with these loan payments. Um, there are some stipulations that kind of don't make sense, like if you were making payments before um, I think June or July of 2021 then they're they're trying to say that you wouldn't be eligible but people who went at least seven months without making a payment would be eligible um, but I was watching an attorney talking about it and she was basically saying the loan is the loan so if you're eligible you should be eligible whether you were able to keep up with the payments or not um, and it is between I think 2003 and 2014 um, they weren't completely honest with people about their um, like loan driven income payments um, and a few other things um, even being deceptive about you know how uh, what information they were giving people basically um, also if you had a credit score I think below 669 and you went to one of these these um, for-profit schools you would be eligible so there's a few things that would make you eligible for the the loan forgiveness so again make sure that your address is updated um, of course you can read more there's a lot to read um, there's at least 18 points to read here um, um, the people who were in public service jobs some of them didn't get their loans forgiven as they were supposed to so there's a few things going on here that they're saying that Navient um, allegedly um, is being accused of and that they need to um, 
forgive some of those loans and potentially even maybe have to repay some people. So, again, this is good news for people who um, were having a hard time keeping up with their loan payments and or um, were turned down for something because they were told their debt to income ratio was too high because of the amount of student loans they owe in comparison to their income or potentially other um, maybe loans or credit cards or car notes that you may have had. So I wish you all the best and I hope that this works out for you if you are eligible. Love y'all. Later.